Welcome back to Creature Creator. You guys are way too creative. Look at this. It's a Goomba. This thing is incredible. I grabbed it from the workshop. It even has night vision. Oh my god, this guy is like an assassin. He is so good. All right, I'm going to take on this bird. You know why? Because this Goomba can fly. Have you ever seen a flying Goomba? Okay, there are flying Goombas. I get it. Oh, dude, he even shoots things out of his eyeballs. Or maybe he's crying because he's mega sad. I don't know. Come back, bird. So we're going to be making our own crazy creations today. I'm going to make another video game character. I want you guys to guess who it is. Come on, let's just shoot this bird. Yes, it's not flying away. Told you guys, this Goomba's an assassin. Yes, take out the bird. Oh my God. Look at those tears just flowing out of his eyeballs. This could be the best creation I've ever seen. And the bird is deceased. <laughs> See ya, bird. I call this guy Gregorio the Goomba. All right, let's go ahead and get rid of him. And let's build our own video game character. You guys have to try and guess who this is. This is going to be a good one. Oh, it's going to be one of my best yet. Okay, this guy, he's kind of shaped like this. I think he's a little bit shorter. Let's just shrink him down a tad. There we go. All right, we'll give this guy some legs. He's got skinny legs. So let's just put those in. Yeah, cool. When I see everyone's creations in the workshop, I'm like, man, I'm so bad at making things in this game. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get this guy some eyes so we can see what's going on. Because at the moment, this guy is blind as a bat. No, he's not a bat. Don't guess that he's a bat. That's not it. Okay. There. <laughs> Look at this guy's mouth. He looks so sad. I love him, though. All right, we'll get him some skinny arms. There we go. This guy really needs to go to the gym. His arms are just like matchsticks. He's going to snap. And he's like... Why don't I go to the gym? He's like shrugging. It's because he's probably lazy. I don't know. Give this guy some awesome ears. Now he needs like a kind of a thing on his head like that. Yeah, nice. <laughs> you guys can probably guess who this is already, right? One of the OG video game characters way back on PlayStation and many other consoles. Not trying to give it away. I'm doing my best to give this guy some pants. You know what I mean? You got to cover your butt. That's just number one rule in life. Make sure your butt is covered. There we go. <laughs> okay, I think this guy is ready to paint. Let's see if I can remember what colors he is. Oh, he needs feet. He's got no feet. Sorry, dude. How does he expect to get anywhere without any feet? All right, there we go. These are like awesome shoes. Okay, the color of this guy is like a nice brown. Uh, how's, how's that? Maybe a little bit more orange. This is kind of the best I can do from memory. <laughs> <laughs> I can't remember what this guy looks like. Oh my god. How do we spin? Ow, ow, there's a snake. There's a snake. It's eating me. Run, dude. Okay, can we do anything? Do we have any kind of attack? Oh, I can jump really high. He's got a super fast running move. Uh, he can pick up meat. Picking up meat is his special move. That's it. It's like, ow, ow, I'm being beaten by a snake. I can't do anything except collect meat for some reason. This is such a bad move. If you guys can guess which video game character this is, let me know in the comments. Hopefully I made it awesome enough for you guys to guess. Hey, bird, get out of here. I'm getting to get that bird. Oh, look at that, I can dance. All right, he does have a good, like, sort of special move, I guess. That's kind of awesome. Wow. Well, look what he's doing now. He's skating. He's not running anymore. Dude, come back, bird. Come back. Okay, that guy kind of sucks, so I'm gonna make a big fat guy. All right, this guy is going to be the ultimate animal destroyer. You wait and see, he's going to be incredible. All right, he needs eyes, of course. He can't see. Uh, let's give him these shifty looking eyes. Actually, I'm going to give him these snail type eyes. I like these ones. They kind of remind me of Shrek, but Shrek's ears. That's his mouth. I know it looks like an Among Us sort of eye, but it's not. It's a mouth. Okay, this right here. This is my attack. It's a shooting thing. We're going to shoot lots of spikes. Let's just put a bunch of these things on here. This guy is basically a cactus dude. How many of these can we put on there? Oh, we've got heaps. Dude, that's cool. He's a reverse echidna. He's got the spikes on his stomach. The saddest thing about this guy is he'll never hug a person. Ever. No one would ever want to hug this guy. He'd kill him. Oh, you can even make the spikes more brutal. Wow. Okay, let's give this guy some trees coming out of his head. <laughs> it's just a big tree. There we go. I want this guy to kind of look like he's a walking seed pod. Yeah, there we go. He's got like weird legs up the back here. All right, we'll give this guy the old paint job. Let's get some cool spikes on there. I'm going to make those spikes probably white. Guy's looking pretty good. I'm not happy with that mouth though. I'm going to switch the mouth out for another one. Uh, maybe, oh, maybe something like this. <laughs> or this one. 
One that looks a little bit like a beaver or whatever that is. I don't know what kind of animal that is. He kind of looks like he's wearing a suit. Okay, here we go. This is how this guy walks. He sort of looks like he's walking on stilts. And uh, we're just going to try and shoot. Oh, that's not bad. He fires quite a bit. All right, I'm going to try and take out this snake this time. Come back here, snake. The seed pod is... Hey, he's running away. Yeah, yeah, Take that. Is he dead? No, but it's doing loads of damage. Yeah, we killed the snake. Awesome. All right, now we're coming for the bird. Get the bird. <laughs> this is the dumbest creation I've ever made. He looks like a pear or an avocado, but he's kind of got like an aardvark nose. So it's like aardvark cardo. That's what he is. That's actually a really good name. And he's got like a cherry blossom tree growing out of his head. If you guys have a better name for this weird creation, let me know in the comments. All right, come on. Let's get this bird. Yeah, loads of damage. Another bird bites the dust. Finbire, the bird killer, with his weird avocado monster. Oh, he can swim. That's kind of nice. Oh my god, this thing is incredible. It's Venusaur. Look at this guy. People in their Pokemon creations, man, it blows my mind. Eat the apple. Eat the apple. Hang on, is Venusaur a carnivore? Do you eat meat, bro? You're a plant. Oh, but then again, it's like a Venus. Venus flytrap. That's a carnivorous plant. All right, I guess we have to do it. We have to eat a dog. <laughs> That's what we have to do. I'm sorry about this dogs. I'm coming for you, bro. He's not getting away. Oh yeah, we ate the dog. <laughs> Look at this guy. He is, it looks like a dog himself. Like half plant, half dog. All right, I'm gonna eat the dog. Oh my God, the dog has been devoured. Can he jump over a fence? Oh, he's way too fat. He's just one obese Pokemon. He's no way he's getting over there. Okay, because I've got a flower on my back, I'm going to see if I can attract some bees. Let's go find these bees. Come on, get up the hill. Oh my god, he is mega chunkus. He can't get up there. He is one wide boy. He's just not doing it. Come on. Urgh, run. Use the power of the flower on your back. All right, here we go. All right, I'm going to get these bees. Come on, bees. Check out my flower. Yeah, that's the... Ow, ow, ow. They're biting me. They're just eating me. I'm gonna be dead. I'm dead. <laughs> I just died in the most embarrassing way possible. Oh, oh, there's a coin. Can I pick it up? Oh, I've got no arms. I've only got legs. I've got four legs. No hands. I thought he had like vines and stuff, like vine whip. The plan is to break into the farm. We're gonna do it. And then we're gonna steal the truck. Oh, we're just, we're doing a dance. We're doing a dance on the truck. All right, let's stop that. Let's do the fire dance instead. Ow, ow. Come on, do the fire dance. Do it. Oh my God, the dance cooldown is way too high. That campfire was super effective against me. Let's not go anywhere near that thing. I grabbed another Pokemon from the workshop. Let's load up this guy. It is, oh my God, it looks like an old man with fire on his back. <laughs> it's Cyndaquil, of course. <laughs> okay, it's pretty amazing. It's not quite the Venusaur. Oh my God. Oh, the dog wants to have a piece of this guy. Alrighty. All right, bring it on, Mutt. Let's go. Oh yeah, it's a bite off. Who can bite the fastest? Oh my God, I'm way stronger than you, bro. I am way stronger. The dog died by me staring at it. Look at that really, like, suspicious look I've got on my face. And I have a butt for a mouth. Hey, the sand pit. Let's get near. <laughs> shrink down into the sand pit. There we go. Oh my god, those shrinking physics. They're so realistic. I've got an achievement that I have to get, and it's complete a game of football. How do we, how do we do this? If I'm just playing with myself. This is the most depressing game of football ever. Okay, I reckon we build another Ban Ban character. Let's go. All right, this guy is going to be quite long. A little bit worm shaped. All right, there we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we've got to make him sort of chunky. It's got to be pretty chunky. There we go. Oh yeah, this dude looks pretty cool. I wish you could make your monsters like really massive. All right, then he needs some big old legs. Except these are kind of his arms as well. Oh my God, I can't see. <laughs> I need eyes. All right, and it's got to have a mouth. Oh, what sort of mouth are we going to go for? I reckon this one. Yeah, dude. That is bang on the money. All right, and his eyes are a bit like this, I think. How do we change these eyes a bit? Can we make them bigger? Okay, rotate the eyes around. <laughs> I like the look of this guy. All right, big arms. All right, super massive. This guy goes to the gym just with his arms. Can we put any decorations on his arms or does it only work on his body? Yeah, I think it's, I think you can only put stuff on the body. That kind of sucks a little bit. 
I wish you could decorate the arms. Okay, well, I put some of these glowy things on his back. Let's just change their shape, rotate them around. Oh, yeah, they, they look really cool. He's kind of like a worm that can see in the dark. I am, of course, building Nibbler, but we're a tad limited to what we can do, so we're kind of just changing him up a little bit. You know what I mean? It's the remix. That's what it is. Oh, yeah, this guy's gonna look amazing. Oh, yeah, buddy. All right, let's paint him. So we need to get a bit of a nice sort of yellowy orange color. Sort of like that. Yeah, that's pretty good. Maybe a little touch more orange. All right, we'll make these discs on his back a bit of a darker orange. There we go. This is how you build Nibbler. This guy's gonna be the ultimate biting guy. I wish he could, like, stomp things as well. You know what I mean? Like Hulk slam just animals. <laughs> That'd be kind of awesome. Oh, bro. This guy is massive. Okay, let's see how he works. Yeah, he works exactly as I hoped. He walks on his arms. That's crazy. And look at the way he wiggles his body. Yep, that's exactly what I wanted him to look like, except he doesn't have anything on his arms. He's supposed to have decorations on his arms. That's a bit disappointing. All right, let's go check out the cave and test these. Oh, my God. He can't swim. <laughs> <laughs> He's had a bit of an upgrade, so now he can sprint. Let's go into the cave, see if we can navigate our way through here. Oh, he doesn't have a torch on his face. I tell you, he looks super scary in the dark, though. Oh, my God. How do we get to the cave? I'm lost. Oh, is it down this way? Just follow the crystals? Oh, yeah, there it is. All right, we've made it into the cave. Where's these animals? I want to go and bite one. Nibbler is feeling like a nibble. Dude is super hungry. Hasn't eaten all day. I feel like this cave needs some other, like, monsters and stuff. I think it's got, like, fish. But it needs some, like, cave worms or something like that. Or ghosts. Or Slender Man. <laughs> something. Oh. Oh, what something just happened when I climbed in here? Oh, that was nice. Did that, like, heal me or something? I've no idea. Maybe that's how you get your health back. <laughs> what am I doing? I'm just bouncing in the water. Okay, the anglerfish is coming. We have a very similar mouth. It is a bite off to see who can be the best biter. Come on, bite that little fish's face. Yes, take that. Okay, Nibbler's pretty amazing. He does look a little bit more like a cave monster than a big giant, you know, destructive beast. But I think he works pretty well. Guys, let me know in the comments if there's any characters you'd like to see me build. And I'll catch you guys next time.